In this video, we'll convert from moles of Al2O3 to grams. So we start out with 1.55 moles, abbreviate that MOL, of Al2O3, and we want to get that to grams. So when we have moles here, and we're going to grams, so moles to grams, we multiply by the molar mass. And to find the molar mass for Al2O3, we go to the periodic table, we look up the atomic mass for each element, multiply, add that all together, and we end up with 101.96, and the units are grams per mole. So we're going to multiply these two numbers together, and when we do, we have moles on top and on bottom. They cancel out. We're going to end up with grams. That's what we're looking for. So when these cancel out, we know that we're doing it right. So we end up with 1.55 times 101.96, and we get 158.04 in our unit, that's going to be grams. So to recap, we have our moles, we're going to grams, so from moles to grams, we multiply by a conversion factor, the molar mass, which we find on the periodic table. Moles cancel out, and we're left with grams. This is Dr. B, converting moles of Al2O3 to grams. Thanks for watching.